Parks on the Air. Just focus that on. I thought Parks on the Air was a national program where we would go out to national parks and we would make contacts with the national park and Rick, WB9R. B8 CRTU. WB8. Oh, yeah, I don't want to call you a 9. Don't no, want to, no, don't no. want to give you a promotion. WB8 is that RQ. Inform me it's the state parks. And that uh, his club over in Ohio had done a program about 13 years ago, because that's when it first started. And they finished second in state parks. So I got involved in state parks on the air. And parks on the air basically is a person goes to a state park or a designated area, like a state recreation area, or a fish and wildlife area that has a designated number from the parks on the air national, uh, national organization, and you start making contacts. And if you go to one of those and start making contacts, you call it an activator. So an activator, we'll talk about this a little later, but you want to spot your location, that is, you want to get on the internet on their spotting site, and we'll show you where that is. You spot your location if, you're, if you can. You work from inside the boundary of a designated park. You have to be in the geographical boundaries of the park. Uh, in the case of, for example, Wilbur Wright Fish and Wildlife Area, I used to go down to the office down in uh, Newcastle, but the area is also there just north of uh, farmland on, on uh, 1 on 28, so I can go down there and, and activate from there. You need to get 10 contacts from the park. So if you're an activator, you want to make at least 10 contacts to have a successful activation. Guys run QRP, you know, QRP is low power. They have, sometimes they'll have a difficulty getting 10 contacts. Uh, some of us who run CW, sometimes we have a difficulty. If you don't get 10 contacts, it's called a practice activation because you still want to upload your log to a regional submitter. The activator makes the contacts, the activator logs the contacts, and Tom, Tom, I'm listening, but I'm ready. The activator does the logging. <laughs> you don't have to do the log. The activator does the log, and, act, and, he, and so you want to upload even if you don't, even if you don't have 10 contacts, because if I've got eight contacts, hunters, get credit if I upload. If I don't upload, they don't get any credit. So hunters get credit through our activator logs. So that's an activator. He's in the park, she's in the park, activate. You have a hunter. A hunter would be somebody like Rick or Dwayne, and they'll, they'll check the spot screen. The spot will come up. Uh, I think my first contact was Marvin. What's KF9 LL? NL. 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 Yeah. He always swallowed one of those letters, like I can never remember what it is. And he, he got me on, he spotted me, he, he made the contact for me. And so you 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 see that you see where the where a guy is on this on the spot, and I'll show you the spot later. And you contact that activator at the park and you exchange a call and you uh, all you do is you cue your call sign and your RST. Uh, also some people will send their uh, state. Some activators want the state. You don't need to supply a log. The activator does all the logging. Okay? So, there we go. So, Tom, when it comes time, you can go tomorrow and you can get on your radio. You can check the computer, find an activator, contact that activator, and you're on your you're parks on the air. You're doing parks on the air. <laughs> all right. Turn to the state, Turn to the state park. <laughs> so there's the, the, the website. Uh, I just want to share the website with you, parksontheair.com. And the website is where we go to uh, get our spots. So if I'm an activator, I will, I will go to this website. I will go over here where it says P2A spots, and I'll make a comment. I'll punch on that, and it will come up. And there will be some active spots. KD4CB is at a park, but that's K2913. That would be, well, I'm not going to make people announce that, but he's doing CW down on 1457. So if I were home, I'd get on the radio, I'd crank it over to 1457, I'd get my keyer going, and I'd make a contact. I, I put in my log.
but I don't do anything after that because he's the one that submits the law. And so there's there is how you that, that's how you know whether there's people on or not. They spot they spot for you. All right. Okay, we'll go to part. Uh, okay, here's top hunters all time. The call sign. And you got activate top activators all the time. The call signs over here. K A U T. He works out of Fort Wayne. He's a Fort Wayne guy. I was on the top eight here for a little while, and he's over here this year. K A U T is the number one activator, and we can go to top hunters all the time, and we can go down to the leaderboard. I just want to show you a little bit. Let's type in W B eight. Z R Q, and it comes up. He has worked 175 parks. He's made a total of 211 contacts. He's made five on CW, which is the best mode you can possibly do. <laughs> and, and he's done. <laughs> and he, he's done. He's done 206 on the old voice phone, where anybody can do it. <laughs> I thought you had, I thought you had 200, oh, unique parks. You got 211 contacts, though, but well, 175 yeah, unique parks. Digital. Yeah. Do what? What's that big fat zero on digital? Yeah, I know. <laughs> K B eight S R is it S R S or S C S? S C S. S C S. <laughs> Let's see what he's up to. 201 unique parks. 231 contacts. No, no, CW. Oh, what a wimp. <laughs> two on that, and 229 on phone. So that gives you an idea. That, that's, uh... That don't count today. Now, here's what you want to do. You don't want to compare yourself with other people. For example, Rick's got all these contacts. He's been doing it for how long? Six months? Six months. Six months. Dwayne's been doing it for years. <laughs> but Dwayne, wait a minute, Dwayne's doing it mobile. So he, yeah. he, all of his contacts are mobile. So he's only competing with himself. He's not, he's not competing with, with Rick because that's apples and oranges. All right, does that make sense? Yeah. And I, okay, now let's see. Let's see the, the good looking ones now. <laughs> 42 unique parks. Oh, golly, man. 43 contacts, <laughs> 38 CW, all right, and five phones, no, I'll leave it. Uh, I got those, this is the reason why you don't, don't want to compare yourself to others, I got those as an activator. Somebody in another park contacted me, so I get credit for being a hunter. It's called park to park contact. You work 20 the day I came over. That's right, I work 20 plus. That's you get the credit two ways. Let's go back to uh, activity. Let's. Uh, where are we going to go? Let's go back here. Top activators. Let's try. Let's try activators. Now uh, activators. W B eight. The Z R Q. Zero. <laughs> that's it. I'm a hundred. Okay, A that's me. I got fifty-five activations, fifty-one unique parks. I got nine hundred and nine total contacts. Total contacts yeah. You know now Dwayne looked at that and he said, You got nine hundred contacts already? But I'm an activator. Right. So you know that's 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 not that's just apples and oranges. Okay. And I've got oh eight hundred and ninety two CW. Oh yeah. <laughs> and I got 17 contacts. I got 17 because I was at a park and I had nine active. I had nine contacts on CW, and I wasn't going to leave with nine contacts. I decided to be more vile, and I turned over to the phone band, and I made a few contacts on phone. Well, you got late night, <laughs> and I got late night. You got late night. I got some late nights. I got I got some late nights. Okay, there's all kinds of awards you can get. I, I, and uh, Rick and Wayne brought their books, their brag books. You can get late night awards. What I want to talk about is a club. Uh, May the 12th, I think it's May the 12th, is our Indiana QSO party. And you can run, if you run from inside a park, you can do parks on the air and you can do the Indiana QSO party. And you can do it as a club. 
To do it as a club, you have to have three individuals doing it. Three individuals don't have to be at the same location as far as that goes. <laughs> All right. Now here's my setup when I'm out on the, out on the field. This is when I'm camping. Portable. I got my I got battery power. I got a oh I hate to see this. I got a Yezu 857. Please don't tell anybody. I got a Makia straight key <coughs> microphone. I'm all set, ready to go. Got my log, got my, uh, got my uh, computer ready to put my logs in. This is uh, this is when I whenever I'm camping, I use a buddy pole uh, uh, antenna. You can see my kayak there. I was I'm, I was camping. Uh, I don't use that when I'm going from park to park because it just takes too long to set up. It's just too long to set up and too long to tune. I use a mobile unit when I'm going from park to park like this. This is a ham stick. Uh, and you, this was this was my very first activation. This was Lake Summit. It was about 105 degrees in the shade. And you see, I had artificial shade. This is a picture that uh, Rick took of me just Tuesday last over at Grand Lake St. Mary's. I learned. I, I did all that. I used to do all my contacting from outside in 20 degree weather. Didn't matter what. I I got smarter. <laughs> I got smarter. I found out I could do it in the car. And so I've got it in the car ever since. To? Do what? Is that when you went from CW to phone to? Yeah, no, no, that's, I'm on CW. You can see my key here. You were on phone that day. I was on, I had, yep. yes, I yes, was. You were. <laughs> I've got this one guy in our club that after I work CW, I have to call him. <laughs> phone contact. Because he can't do Because he, he won't call me. <laughs> you have to call me from now on when I'm done. Anyway, there we are. We're, we're, we're working in, in the car that way. And that's, that's, that's very possible. Rick came over. Uh, we had a good time. We, 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 contacted, uh, we contacted Dwayne. Had to contact him on phone because he won't do see that. <laughs> <laughs> and this is too broad, but this is Rick's station. This is, this is the station of a hunter. <laughs> I got that off of his Facebook page. And he's there, and he, he can hunt from there. And that's where he got, he's got his contacts from there. While I'm, while I'm in the park at 105 degrees, fighting the mosquitoes, sweat ripping off, he's there in his ham shack with his feet up, his adult beverage in his hand, working, working. That's what hunters do. We activators do that. We do that. Without hunters, I'm absolutely nothing. You're right. You're right. And, it, and I always thank the hunters for my activations. And we thank you. For my activations. Uh, Rick told me to take out my map. And <laughs> I'm getting some competition. And uh, write down all the parks on my map, which I did. I wrote down all the parks. That way it's easy for me to pull out, see where the parks are. And after I work them, I circle them. You don't have to, you can work them more, more than once, you know. Yep. So but there's a site on the on the uh, POTA site. You, blank here, there. That you can you all can right. click on it. And it will recognize your location and bring up all the parks within a 50 mile. Well, we'll take it in or something. Like that. Right here, right on the side, it says, click here for details how to get started. So you just click there, and it just tells you how to get started. You can run QRO, that's the man's man. Or you can run QRP like Rick does, which will pull your hair out because it's very good. Okay. All kidding aside, I do CW because it's challenging. I don't find the phone to be challenging. These guys who run QRP, they do it because it is challenging. It's a challenge to go out there to park, run five or ten watts, and get those. He's contacts. got it. He's got it. It's going to do. It's going to do the parks in, these, in the general location. Here's our. Here we are. And here's our yeah, park. There they are. And you can just click on a park, right there, and they bring it up. That's Bad Cell, Leonard Wood State Nature Reserve, just south of Decatur, two miles. There's just barely enough room to get in. <laughs> but I worked that. Here, this would be Wabash. That's, that's, that word up there is French for Wabash. Go over here, where I was last Tuesday, St. Mary's, and just tell you the park. <coughs> I'm going to go down here to southern Indiana, southern <coughs> west, southwestern Ohio, work Houston Woods tomorrow. Come on. Once in a while, you get lucky and you'll snag three operators running three different parks, and they pass it from one operator to the next. 
And each one gets They'll say, hold them. on. You get the next one, he'll give you the identifier, give you a, a signal report, and you'll say, hold on, pass it on the next one. Next thing, you're just sitting down there making points, just left and right. So, it's a lot of fun, then. All right, questions? You guys got any questions? This is, my, uh, this is my go pack. Now, for a QRO guy, but in here I have my MF, I have my MFJ analyzer because I got it to my antenna. This is my antenna, which I will put together when I'm out there. Got my keyer. I've got a spare microphone because one time my microphone was on the blink brink. <laughs> blink. I use it. I have a I have a key as well as a keyer because sometimes you need a backup for that. When you travel a long ways to work a park, you want to work a park. <laughs> you don't want to screw up. You don't want to have it not working because something breaks. Right. Well, I have a question for you. All right. And I, I'm now, sure I can think up of an answer, but I don't know it. Do you bring a spare set of relays? <laughs> I do. I got them from Tom. Okay. Remember I was very generous with my relays. <laughs> <laughs> you have that. Well, and you, you said it was a key once in a while. For those who want to see what certificates look like, yes. <laughs> you can come up here and look at my bride's book. <laughs> You bring yours, Dwayne? Yeah, I can bring his. So I have <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, just remember, these guys are competing among themselves. Now he did. He, 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 he doesn't have any certificates, so we'll show you ours. <laughs> yeah, I've got four more that haven't been issued yet. I'm too cheap. Yeah. I am too cheap to print them off. I don't want to use my, my ink. <laughs> You've written this whole plan pretty well. Yeah, I you actually go on the site, and when you get awarded, it'll show up. And then you go down, you can just print them off right on your computer. Yeah, you don't have to but apply you, for the awards. They, you know, they, just, they, they automatically happen. Daryl, thank you very much. You're welcome. Uh, thank you. This shows the good job. The uh, versatility of the hobby. Uh, I know uh, Gil and uh, AZO Dave have went out to some uh, parks, local parks, and picnic areas and stuff just uh, to play radio. They go out and they could be they could be getting certificates. They go out and eat on their. Uh, they go out and eat on city their, parks. Uh, <laughs> city parks. City parks. No, it has to be the has to be the has to be designated. Yeah, that's to uh, be a state state designated. Can't right. be a, a local park unless it's a state park also. Gotcha. We appreciate your time, yeah. Mr. Morgan. Yeah. Good, Good job. job. You know, uh, Back to the hospital for your uh, duties there. Um, Mr. Cobb has a, a card and a receipt for you back here for your dues. No, I don't. I did, I did remember to pay it for you. Uh, back here in the barrel. Uh, sure. I'm surprised the Marine could figure that out. Ooh. <laughs> I know we, we spend so much time babysitting the Navy that it's just well, hard to have time for anything else. Attaboy. <laughs> Daryl, thank you very much for that. You're welcome. I hope we spark some interest because it's a, more, it's a lot more fun doing it, with, doing it with people. So, you know, we do field day. We do, uh, maybe we can do the Indiana Cusco party from a park. As a club. Pretty educational. I'm a club. I didn't know any. Oh, well, I have a communication drill. Yeah. <laughs> you need any help getting that stuff back up? I do not. Right. I do not. Right. We Marines. Hoorah. <laughs> 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 he got you there, Tony. He got you. He got me. <laughs> we, we can drop it. This is easy. We're just, we Marines are just as fouled up as the Navy. <laughs> We're proud of it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thanks again. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.